Okay, within a 20 minute range, 15 minute range of going, oh fuck, I can't talk, of hearing that combat, obvious combat, kill, God willing, God, please, the good guys finally took down William Murray, he's such a savage terrorist, the terrorism I have witnessed William Murray and Gwendolyn Ball do daily, nightly, for four years. Oh my God, I can't talk anymore. No, I pray to God these murderers finally got what they deserved. I pray to God it was William Murray because someone came up in the cubby hole. They, I heard him jump down and then poof, they got it, dude. You're fucking with the best, f excuse my language for cussing, God damn it. You're fucking with the best fucking counter terrorist vets I can't speak now. My mouth, everything goes. Oh. These people have destroyed me here. The people of Washington, D.C. destroyed me. I hardly speak now. I went to the bathroom and after I closed the door for about 10 seconds, I clearly heard <clears throat> who I believe was Ball, the female bomb maker, ISIS terrorist talking loud but not trying to be heard <clears throat> she or whoever the female was it sounded like ball but I didn't see them was in how do you say I can't speak any more hold on the female terrorist I heard was upset, not happy, in trouble, sounded, sounded in trouble. And then that female got quiet again, super quiet. I finished using the bathroom, flushed the toilet, opened the door, no sound, nothing, no one there, no sound. I stood, listened, Longer, no sound, no one, nothing. Okay, <clears throat> my green light is this female murderer, disgusting, violent, violent female in the ISIS terrorist cell. <laughs> murderer. Violent, violent woman, sick, sick human being is hiding in this house. I have to be careful and I cannot leave my room again. I am trapped again in the room. That is why... I struggle to speak because I have been trapped 
in a room in Washington, D.C. for years. The email is in here. I pray that she gets what she deserves very soon. I pray that that man who protected her, his name William Murray, got what he deserved.